Yo what's going on everybody, in this video I'm going to be unboxing the Ryzen 5 5500 I'm really excited for this processor because I need a new one Because my Ryzen 3 is not working at all when I'm streaming So I'm really happy for this, we are going to do an unboxing on this processor right now If you guys want a review it will come in the future But for now we're just going to do an unboxing on the Ryzen 5 5500 I'm really excited for this so let's quickly get our knife over here and let's open this um, processor so as you guys can see here is a seal a seal over here so we quickly just going to cut that over here and uh, basically I think that's it that is how it's open opened up let's quickly see what you are greeted with if you open the box so okay this is what you are greeted with I believe this is the fan over here so let's take this out I'm gonna put that aside let's take the instructions out and of course this is the processor guys this is really cool so this is basically what you get in the box you get the Wraith style cooler we will check this out in a bit but this is the processor guys look how cool this looks um, you get a little Ryzen sticker in there so I don't know why they included the Ryzen sticker but it's pretty cool Ryzen 5000 series sticker over there if let's just see if this camera can focus a little bit that will be quite cool. Okay, so as you guys can see, it's a Ryzen 5000 series over there. And this is how the, the processor looks um, close up. So yeah, it looks pretty cool as you guys can see. Just excuse my shaky hands, guys. I'm really bad at keeping things still. But yeah, this is a Ryzen 5 5500. I'm really excited for this. As I just said that like five times. But it's okay, guys. It's okay. But this is the pins at the back. Okay, so this is good. But I'm not going to take it out of the box right now. Because I need to put it in my PC. And I'm going to make a video of that today as well. But let's just keep it in the packaging over there just to not damage it or something. Um, let's just open this Wraith style cooler guys. Because like I feel like you guys probably want to see if there's thermal, thermal paste pre-applied. Because I know I um, asked on YouTube and I couldn't decide if this thing had thermal paste pre-applied. So that's what we are going to figure out for you guys today okay. We're going to take this one out. Oh, this thing is so heavy it's pretty good. Um, and I think yes, thermal paste is pre applied as you guys can see. Thermal paste is pre applied, so that's pretty good. And uh, yeah, it's basically just okay to, out of the box, you can just add it on your processor and it will work. Of course, I'm not going to use the pre applied thermal paste, I am going to add some new thermal paste I bought because just because, guys, I think it's a little bit better. But I'm going to put this um fan back in here for later so i can go put it in my pc uh with my friend or something oh my how do you get this in here actually um this is a bit difficult guys okay there you go it's inside over here in in the box we're just gonna close this up again for later because i'm gonna put this in my pc in a bit but um what is this important please read processor contained in the package please know the manner okay this is just like something they basically want to say you need an AM4 um, socket in your motherboard so make sure you have an AM4 socket in your motherboard guys really important and then instructions we just have some extra instructions over here I'm gonna show you guys the specs of this um, the CPU if if it's even up here I don't know I think it's on the sticker okay so basically this is the processor it's a 6 core 12 thread processor it has a 4.2 gigahertz max boost and 3.6 gigahertz base boost and it has um i think it has 16 megabytes l3 ca cache or something cache i don't know what it's called but it's basically that so it's pretty good i had a ryzen 3 4300 ge it only came with four megabytes um uh, l3 cache so that's pretty that's not that's not going to work at all guys like i don't know who is going to be okay with four megabytes for streaming and gaming but this processor might be decent for me when i stream now guys i'm really excited for this so let's go i say that the seventh time but it's fine guys so hopefully you guys enjoyed the unboxing of the ryzen 5 5500 guys and uh yeah some stay tuned for me reviewing this uh, processor and putting it in my pc thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in the next one peace out